If this year has taught us anything, is that being able to work from home is worth its weight in gold. Bills have to be paid and money has to be saved. So in this video, I'll go over some of the best work from home jobs in 2020. My name is Cairo and I'm obsessed with learning how to make money and still have a life. So crush the like button and let me give you what you came here for. So the first work from home job I want to talk about is online tutoring. This was how I initially got started. I started tutoring other kids in my class when I was in high school and I built up this business through high school and university for a total of eight years. And it was a great little business. I even employed some other people to teach subjects that I couldn't do myself. And I would teach math and English and science. And the great thing now is that it's even easier to do this online, especially with all the different sites that offer this, or you could work for yourself just posting your services on sites like superprof or tutors.com and you can easily earn around $50 an hour or more depending on your services and the rates that you set. You could even become a super tutor charging hundreds of dollars an hour teaching high net worth families. You're also not limited to teaching school children. You could also be teaching college students, university students, you could be teaching people that want to learn a specific skill like marketing or graphic design. The online education world is totally booming, so there's definitely room in it for you to make some money. Now the next great work from home job is to sell a skill as a freelancer. Now there are loads of these sites online where you can go and post your services on sites like Upwork or Fiverr. And these services could range from social media management to virtual assistant to Facebook ads manager, web design, SEO, content creation, video editing. And these skills will be potent weapons for you to use in the future as you work with other businesses or even if you start your own. And don't worry if you don't know how to do any of these things. In a relatively short time using things like YouTube, you can teach yourself enough about a skill to be able to start charging money for it. Now, if you don't currently have a skill that you can sell, don't worry because it's actually relatively easy to learn a skill in a short period of time. We've got loads of free resources online like YouTube and whatnot. And if you don't want to sift through YouTube finding out the knowledge that you need, you can also do a more focused course on it on something like Skillshare or Udemy. So for example, for my YouTube channel, I learned pretty much everything I now know about video editing in a course on Skillshare. It took like 10 hours to do the course and it pretty much equipped me with everything I needed to get started with my YouTube channel. So I'll pop a link down to Skillshare in the description if you want to get a free trial on that. And on those things, you can learn Facebook ads manager or you could learn how to be a social media manager or you can learn about website design or copywriting. And these are all valuable skills that you can then sell to businesses on platforms like Upwork. Now the next work from home job category I want to talk about are sales jobs. Now sales jobs vary massively. You could be selling boats, you could be selling insurance, you could be selling pharmaceutical products. There's a huge range because having skills in sales is kind of necessary in whatever type of work you will be doing to some degree. Now sales jobs generally have a base salary, which is fairly low generally, and then they have tiered commission levels. So the better you do, the more targets you hit, the more money you make. So there's lots of potential in sales jobs to make a huge amount of money depending on how skilled you get at the job. Learning how to sell is an incredibly valuable skill that you'll use in your personal life as well as professionally. And by understanding how to sell stuff, you'll actually probably end up saving money in your future, especially with like real estate agents or insurance brokers down the line just in your personal capacity. So, so improving on your selling ability will help you throughout life immeasurably. Now a book that I strongly recommend is a book called Influence by Robert Cialdini or Cialdini, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. I'll pop a link down in the description to that. It's called Influence and it really gives you an insight into the consumer behavior and how people buy and what influences them and how to influence people and how you are influenced yourself. So it's a really interesting read and it will help you a lot if you decide to pursue some kind of sales job. The next way to make money from home is through an online course. So what do you know? Have you been to university? Did you learn a skill there? You could be skilled at knitting, you could be skilled at surfing. Anything that you are pretty good at, you can turn into an online course. And especially now with people working from home or being confined to the house or being forced to having to stay home, people want to learn things online. 
Now, once you've created your course material, you can host it on places like Skillshare or sites like Udemy, or you can build your own sales page, have a sales funnel, run ads to it. That's probably the way to make the most money. And if you're not sure how to do that, you can DM me on Instagram because that's what I do for a marketing agency. I build these sales funnels and run these ads to sell people's products. Now, the great thing with an online course is that it will take you time to build it out initially. But after that, once you're running ads and you have a way to get people into your sales funnel, it is a relatively easy way to continue to make money. You only need to make that course material once and then you can sell it for long periods of time after that. Perhaps you might wanna tweak it and adjust it over time if the information becomes outdated, but that's why online courses are considered a form of passive income. Next up, we have transcribing or transcription services. Now, essentially what that is, is you listen to an audio file and you have to write down what they're saying. This is still really relevant because it's quite difficult to get an AI bot to do this work properly. Now, you may have to sign up to a few different companies at first in order to get enough work. But once you've worked for the different companies, you'll be able to see which one works best for you, which one pays the most and which ones suit your schedule. Now, here's a pro tip. You get paid per audio hour. So that's not per actual hour, it's per hour of audio that you get through. So the goal with transcription is to obviously be able to type out the words that you're hearing as quickly as possible. Now, all pro transcribers use pro transcription software. So they use some software that makes it easy for them to rewind, fast forward, slow it down without changing the pitch of the audio. And they use a foot pedal and the foot pedal helps a lot because using your feet you'll be able to rewind or fast forward without having to move your hands from the keyboard to the mouse so basically you're giving yourself extra limbs to help you do your work so if you're interested in becoming a pro transcriber I've put a link down below to some of that pro transcription software as well as to a foot pedal that you can get on Amazon parlez-vous français well, next up, a good way to make money from home is through a translation service. Now, the pay varies massively for translators. It depends on how many words you can get translated, the quality of your translations, and whether you work for an agency or directly with a company. ProZ.com is a great site to find translation jobs, and I'll link to a great article in the description that outlines different salary scenarios that you might be able to achieve. For example, if you're working for an agency, you might earn less and have to put in more audio hours than if you work directly with a company because then you can set your own rates. With low quality translations, you could earn probably around $40,000 a year, up to well over $100,000 depending on your quality, your speed, and whether you're working through an agency or directly with clients. Are you still here? If you're still with me in this video, crush the like button and subscribe for more videos like this every week. Also, if you're still with me, that means you understand English and that means you have a skill that you can make money from. Teaching English online is a lucrative and fairly straightforward way to make money because English is a coveted skill that lots of places in the world, lots of people around the world want to learn. And there are loads of different sites offering teaching English as a foreign language, teaching English as a second language opportunities. Now the average pay to teach English as a second language is around $15 to $25. Obviously, if you get private students, then that falls more into the online tuition world and then you can charge far more than that. But if you're working for one of these teaching English as a second language agencies, the pay will probably be around $18, $20. Many sites require a TESOL or a TEFL certificate. These are basically certificates saying that you've gone through a training to teach English as a foreign language. But there are other sites that don't require you to have such a certificate. They might want you to have a college or university degree. Some even only require that you have a high school diploma. And some might require you to take a proficiency test just to show that you are actually going to be able to do the job. So I'll pop a link down to an article that's really helpful that lists a whole bunch of different teaching English as a foreign language sites that you could apply to. Next up, we've got a bonus resource and that is on one of the Reddit subreddits and it is called Beer Money. Now it sounds funny and it is kind of funny, but you can go and browse on Beer Money and find 
little jobs that you can do to make a little bit of extra money from home. Word of caution, some of them might be a bit dodgy, so take them with a pinch of salt, read the reviews, read how many upvotes it's gotten, read the description, read the comments, and then whatever they are suggesting in Beer Money, just take that into a new Google tab, type it out, and just see if it looks legit or not. Now you can watch my other side hustle make money videos over here, such as couch flipping and Airbnb properties. And if this video was helpful, crush the like button and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.